delicious. Hi guys, welcome to Where Beyond Pad Thai channel and tonight we are on the Yang Rat Road in Chinatown, Bangkok, Thailand. And today we're gonna eat a lot, like I with my cameraman. Yeah. <laughs> Last year I also did this video about Yawarat Road and what to eat and what not I have received such a good feedback so this year again 2019 let's eat go 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 this is how you lose a whole generation in one move six people in one yeah this is how you lose a generation six people one two three four five six this is like super cool. We've been taking photos and stuff without any filter where we get like this like Yeah, and we are actually walking past all this like fancy restaurant and then that Fancy bar. We are going for some street food. So when you come to this, oh hi! When you come to this, Kuei Zap place, this Chinese noodle. There's this deep fried gyoza just right beside. So it's crispy. Stuff with a lot of like meat inside. Yeah, like a rolly like really noodle. <laughs> Delicious. Hot item that you should totally try. Even you order like rice or noodle. Like it's it's crispy it's pork is like real good. Like we don't even need anything to put add on because this is already like very flavorful and peppery. Really peppery. Another one of the Chinese noodle that actually like pretty good also is this one. Right in front of the old cinema. Really peppery and flavorful. Just as good. Do you have a video on that? Yeah, but check it out. From last year. <laughs> It's actually off the main street a little bit. Yeah, you find it. <laughs> Here they're actually well known for the food on the sizzling pan. This is like a really hot pan. Before this, like when, when this serve up first, it's like you would be like, wow. Wow. Here, what we got is the oyster omelet, and then this one is like a stir fry suki, vermicelli, vegetable, pork, all in here. Looks so good right now. Let's dive in. Yeah. Mm. Oh. Yeah, I'm not eating that right now. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be blistered up in like 2.1 seconds. Now it's oyster omelet. Eggs, of course, sunflower, a little bit of bean sprout, chili sauce on there, and have a bite. Go up! Where did it go? Right there. It's hot. <laughs> I know. <laughs> because it's sizzling pan. Is that egg? Yeah. Okay. Not bad. It's oyster omelet. That thing's too special, Bob. I think this is better. Yeah. I think this has vegetables in it. It has like cabbage on the bottom, I think. And that one doesn't have vegetables. If that had more vegetables, it'd be really good. 
also the sauce. The food was sizzling good, just don't order the drink here. It's pretty gross. Do not use the cups there or the ice bins. They just dip it in water and they pull it out. Disgusting. It's pretty much just like plum juice from the random stall. That's sour plum. So the sour plum, the syrup. Step it out together and mix it with water. Yeah. Ah. Oh. It's like a sour lime almost. It doesn't have the after flavor, but it gives you like a lime. Like, woo. of a curry smell and taste. Yeah, it's good. It's just good. It's like not too strong of a curry. At the same time, this serve it with, <gasps> with cucumber, like good, with like the texture all together in one bite. Do you like? It's good. Kind of pouring out from all the other food. My favorite forever forever since I was in the university I found out about this and then I have to come for this like every time when I come to Yawara in Chinatown the dessert that we're gonna be getting really interesting and exciting so this we call it Buoloi Nam King which in English pretty much means the rice dough ball in ginger tea but at the same time they got like a black sesame inside of it not only that this place is not just like like ground sesame you know but it's something else let me show you guys at the same time mm, a lava of this black sesame like coming out like outside is soft the dough is really soft really like really good texture ginger's strong enough that it burns your throat a little bit that explains how hot the, or how strong the ginger is that reminds me of black sesame it was like ground up with peanut butter for some reason it's like a peanut buttery not texture, but like an after flavor, but like a strong black sesame starting flavor. With this all together in one bite. Mm. Messy bun, messy bun, messy bun. See how messy it is? Down. Those are like all the, all the stuff from the bun that we bought before eat and then it dropped but then you guys unfortunately we've been eating so much i don't think we can like stuff anymore in this one if we like bring it home it's not gonna be as good but if you if you have watched my video before you probably have seen like um sometime because i've been having this like in quite a few videos already if you come to yawarat in chinatown totally a must because it's like it's a bun, like a crispy bun that inside like a little soft, nice stuffing, chocolate, and the uh, milk one. Those two are my favorite. Yeah, totally check it out, but you would probably have to wait a little bit. So many people, like usually it's more than this actually, like this is not as many as usual. <laughs> done the 
pretty much the same place right here, which is, yeah, we're at Roa, Chinatown. If you guys want to check it out, like, what's changed on my list, a must last year and a must this year, don't forget to check out that episodes as well. I hope you guys enjoy it and I'll see you guys in the next video. Oh, don't forget to subscribe to Wavy on Hatai channel and I'll see you guys in the next video. And at the same time just serve it with guava that guava? Not guava. Cucumber. <laughs> <laughs>